Good morning, good evening, and good night, everybody. Um, same day for me, different day for you guys, but uh, I did have to pause for a little bit, um, and so I just decided to kind of end that one and start a new one because uh, I had a special delivery just around lunch, and I have been so excited to get this here. Um, I, If you can't tell from behind me, I am definitely a um, Ghostbusters fan and if you watched the previous video you might notice that there's something currently missing from my bookshelf. That's because the proton pack arrived today! <laughs> so I was able um, for, uh, my husband was able for a present for me to uh, join in on the Kickstarter for the giant beautiful Hasbro proton packs and so that arrived today and so I have just spent the last hour and a half um, unboxing, exploring the box, which is gorgeous, just like the, the toolbox here, um, for the, for the neutrino wand, the, uh, the box for the pack is a footlocker and it has hidden secrets and all sorts of fun little tidbits and snippets, uh, as well as lots of, uh, lots of bits and pieces. So it has to hold the stand and the pack, uh, as well as the, um, accoutrements that will go with. Hasbro outdid themselves with this one. It is fantastic, and I am going to go ahead and pick it up. Uh, don't laugh at me, because <laughs> it's huge. Um, I'm going to pick her up. I'm going to bring her over here so you guys can see. And then I'll show you the box, too, because it's really flippin' cool. And then we'll go back to playing Barry Breakfast. <laughs> because who needs... Um, you don't. Y'all don't need an entire video of me gushing over this Proton Pack. If you want a video of someone gushing over the Proton Pack, go see what Adam Savage did with his. He has uh, multiples of them in his shop, and one of them he has completely uh, done a little, he did a little bit of revamp, a little new weathering, a little extra stickering, um, some, some you know, upgrades to his. He, he went ahead and put the Atlas Pack on it as well, and uh, I'm gushing over Ghostbusters at the moment, and so, okay, so let me show you the Proton Pack. It's gorgeous. Okay, this thing is huge. Look at it, isn't she beautiful? Okay, so I have the wand attached, obviously. Um, and, the, and the original wand, when I got it, I, proved, I got it prior to the orange tipping. Uh, so if I ever take this one to a con, I will have to orange tip her. But, um, and they send you that along with it, just in case you needed it. The uh, wand itself is a separate unit, and the cording came with the pack. And the wand turns the pack on and off. I'm um, gonna do just a little bit of that. I may have every, everything turned off, so hold on. Yeah, I have everything else turned off. Um, that's me. So just we'll turn it on for just a second, and then we'll turn. Let's see if we can get everything turn on for us. It's beautiful. It's wonderful. It does all the wonderful, fantastic things that I want it to do and more. Um, so it's beautiful. I may have not. There we go. She's so pretty. Look at those beautiful lights. You can see the cycle down here. You probably can't hear me now. But that's okay. I'm going to turn it back off. So I wasn't expecting this for a little while and um, I was expecting it to be later the, in the year. So I am super excited about <laughs> my proton pack coming in and I'm going to put her away real quick and then I will grab the box. The stand is pretty too, but the stand is not as gorgeous as the rest of the pieces. And I'm going to have to find a really good place to store this. I'm thinking I might hang it on the wall over on the opposite side. Not this wall. This wall's too close to me. Look at that box. Guys, look at the box. Okay? Look at the gorgeous decaling. Look at the gorgeous design. You've got your very own foot locker. Anyway. Enough of me gushing. 
that's five minutes of me gushing about a proton pack that has nothing to do with the rest of my channel. So <laughs> let's get into a little more Baron breakfast. Uh, I haven't done anything since I pressed stop on the last video. Uh, so we shall see what else trouble wise we can get into. Um, we've got a couple of things game wise to do. All right, so we've got to complete some more st uh, stays and get our cabin to a prestige level. I wonder if I went ahead and built another one of those nice beds. If we could bump it, because we are at a level three. So let's, let's do, I didn't already build one, right? Perfect. Let's build another nice bed, right? And then, did that build the bed? Okay, good, good, good. And then let's build, build this vanity table and see if that helps and okay so we're gonna remove this bed kind of put a shiny little bed in there right it's a little more crowded but it's prettier um let's take let's put a vanity table in I wonder if I take this mirror out and I put it in this room and then I take this and put it in here. That should still keep my my level up there. We're still at a level three. Let's see what else we can replace, what else we can do, okay? Mm. All right, we're gonna exit, because that helps. Let me go see what else we can do update things, clear up some trash, let's see what our quest log says our easiest way to, Hmm. Okay. What's my next best way to raise prestige? Because I have just bumped the beds. Sum of all decoration scores across the resort. Alright, let's go see if we can get some more decorations. you got in the dump. Okay. I like the snake plants because they're they're good for that. Looking for things that I don't like the possum clocks. I know they give you quite a bit more, but I don't like them. I'm gonna put a floor. This is a floor lamp, so we'll see if we can put another floor lamp in there. I need I need prettier stuff. You know what I mean? Like I need excess things that I can add to the cabin. She's apparently a night owl. All right, let's see, what can we add? Um, we have a floor lamp and we were adding that to, I wonder if, can I move this and put this in, in its place? Not enough room, huh? If I put, can I put it here now? I can. Can I still put, I'm gonna put this little plant right there. That'll work. I need to go clean up trash after this person because she's trashy. Let's put a snake plant out here. I'm just trying to raise the level of our 
decorated rooms. Oh, you have two of those. You have a snake plant too. Mm. What if I put this in here and gave you a snake plant? Okay. So let's see, this room, 15 and 20, 12 and 20, 12 and 29, or thir 13 and 29. Okay. All right. All right. We're not quite at level four yet, and that's fine. We are are we booked for the next couple of days? Like, do we have, have one active guest? All right, let's see. Arrives tomorrow, arrives tomorrow, leaves tomorrow. Okay, so bedroom three, which is a 12 and a 20. Let's do... And you're going to go in bedroom three. Okay. Just cleaning your trash out, lady. All right. Let's go check on the motel. And see what's going on down there. Guys, I'm just, I'm giddy. <laughs> I... Did not expect to be this excited about a silly little. All right, let's check the room structure here. Okay, I have leaves in two days, leaves tomorrow. So tomorrow I need to book another room. All right, that's fine. What else can we do? No, I can't really do much. I've got anything over here in the better stash. Let's go get rid of these two beds that we don't need. Um, I'm going to hold, please. <coughs> Sorry, I didn't get the mic cleared fast enough. I'm just gonna edit that bad boy in. We're out. Whew. these boxes. So is that just a trash can? Okay. He doesn't have any sort of quests. I'm not seeing anything quest-wise in through here. We're doing fine on the on the tracker over here. We've got things going. Run through the dump, collect some more stuff, get materials because the more we have, the easier it is to complete the quests as we come through them. Clear all this stuff and then we're gonna get, we're gonna go to sleep. Although, it's n almost morning anyway. So. Alright, let's go to sleep. Go to sleep, go to sleep. Alright. Four guests arrived. Two guests are completed. Yes for the funds. And we've got new stay requests. So let's go add somebody. Oh my goodness. Messy, messy people. We don't make messes in our rooms. Thank you very much. Mm. 
Okay, so bedroom one is empty, 16 and 17. Oh, sorry. 16, 17, and 9. You know what? You can go in um, bedroom one. Okay. So that's prepped. Complete this day. Okay, we're almost there. Let's see what else we can find. I don't have any nicer stuff over here. I just, I keep hoping for updates. And I'm not finding them. Hmm. Can I buy anything I like in here? Because I am bankrolling now. I bet I'm going to need like some serious <laughs> funding to do the next space. Okay, I do like these rugs. Okay, but this dresser is huge. I could put that fir tree in the in the building and it not be Christmas. go back to timber see what we can do up there let's get you specifically this one remove this rug I'm gonna give you a nicer rug. <laughs> I'm gonna put this one under the edge of the bed because it does help. And let's see if I put this little tree in the lodge. Okay. What else can we add in here? Oh, did we make it to four? We made it to four. All right. Cool. That one rug bumped us up. I hear I was worrying about several things. Let's see what we can do next. Is the job complete? Yes. Congratulations. Greatly benefits the location. Guests will now have higher expectations for this location. We'll offer a higher payout in return. Nice. Do you have another quest for me? Build a level three bedroom and host two guests with a pampered trait. Okay. All right. I feel like I already have a level three bedroom. Level two, level three bedroom. No. It's making Okay, uh, I had to go run see Lego Bowser. Lego Bowser has been finished today in there. I also for, for realized I grabbed, I forgot to grab one of these guys. Look, aren't they cute? They came with the proton pack. 
Uh, so they're, they'll be all over it when I pack it, when I finally stick it on the wall. Um, okay. Let's finish. We got it to Prestige 4. We need a room at level 3. If any room's going to be a level 3, it's going to end up being this one. And let's see. What else can we add to this room to make it... I don't know. We'll figure it out. Okay, so... Hmm. I feel like I need better schematics to make that happen. And I'm just gonna go collect some more stuff for a minute. So tell me in the comments what your... Obviously you know what several of my favorite things are. If you can tell behind me, uh, you know, the Ghostbusters pack. We've got Stitch over there. Uh, Y'all can't see him very well, but Rodney Copperbottom's up there. I've got a ton of uh, other little fun references. Gouda's over there in the corner. Nightmare Before Christmas is behind me. Um, yeah, tons of stuff. So, as you can tell, I'm a nerd. <laughs> I'm a total geek. And that's okay. I love that about me. I love that about people. I love seeing them get excited about things that they love. So, this is something that I will always be happy to see is when content creators share the things they love. So, tell me about... Tell me about your faves. What's your favorite old movie? What's your favorite genre? What is your, you know, what what are your goals for your your collection? What do you collect? Uh, obviously, I don't collect any one specific thing. I um, I collect a lot of things. <laughs> I feel like we need a better recipe to complete that next one, and I don't think we're going to get a better recipe for a little bit based on the way this game is built. So I'm wondering if I can even complete that on the up again. Go down to the A. Go down to the A24. Is that like the B52s? Or are we silently judging me now? It's fine. It's fine. I'm used to that. <laughs> no new blueprints. No, nothing helpful. Um, let's go to the dump. Let's go recycle these two beds. Apparently I found a dead zone. I wonder if that means he's not really alive. recycle these beds. kind of run out of things to do and I don't want to make boring videos of me just wandering can I make another bathroom
All right, let's make another bathroom and then we'll make a bedroom. So that's how big it has to be. And then I can make one more bedroom. We've now made another bathroom. Now I need to make one more of these. I need to make some more beds. Okay, now I need to make another bed like this one. Let me make two more of those. And give me one of these where I have foot rests and a shabby table. How about that? And then that way I can make one more bedroom. Uh-oh, do I not have enough space there? I need to know. Do I not have enough space there? One, two, three, four, one, two, three, four. Cannot make a bedroom here. Why won't it let me make a bedroom here? I had the, uh, ah. so we're going to hit exit out of that. Absolutely just going to distract that room. All right, let's build this room. do that? Why can't I do that? Perfect. Now I should be able to put the door right here and I can put a bed. I don't know why I made two beds. Else have I got? Okay, I need. I appreciate that I can move my inventory around because I totes did not intend on doing that. All right, so let's go escape. Let's go over here and buy. Let's go buy another cute little rug, right? Because I don't have another. I don't have another rug at the moment. I made one of these. Give me one of these. Uh oh, I'm out of. Okay. All right. We got what we could get. We got to find some more wood. Well, that was confusing. Find some more garbage because now I have an extra room that I can rent out. All right, so bedroom four is empty. It's a sixteen, a sixteen, and a nine.
three, three, and a seven. Perfect. Okay, so I have guests booked for each of those rooms. Now I need to go find some garbage. I don't understand the step issue. Like, what is this that they're doing where they're I'm looking for garbage. Oh, I've got it. Let me go ahead and spend a little more garbage. Okay. And now I am officially at zero garbage. And I can put this in this room and make it just a little more a little more decorated bam that way everybody has nice rooms oh that bed was one I was going to switch that bed out that's why <laughs> See, I get excitable about doing other things and then I forget what I'm doing. It's all good. Let's see if we can find some more garbage. They don't make a ton. They don't make, let me put it this way, they don't make as much random garbage as I expected. That makes sense. We're, we're just gonna go to sleep. They don't make as much garbage as I expected. So like, we talk about the humans are bad in this game, uh, but like, I don't. Four guests arrived. Five guests completed their stays. Decent monies. Okay, so motel is good. We got new people coming. I wonder how my reviews went. I'm kind of iffy on that. Like, is there garbage anywhere? No. Okay, before you before you check in, let me fix your bed. Um, inventory. Pull this crappy bed out. I'm gonna put a nice bed in. There. Much better. Much better. Okay. Oh, I broke it. I broke it! It froze. Like, the music is still playing, but the game froze. Let me see if I can get it to do something else, right? Like, it legit, it froze. Woo! Okay. The room's even better than you expected. Yay. Okay, cool. How are my reviews? Five star reviews. Good. With one. I might be tempted to recommend it. So that that one, that one was not as happy. But that's okay. That's okay. That's okay. Heck him. All right, let's go see what the shark has to say. You got all the requirements in check? Press the green button. Amazing. This concludes our foray into the roadside attraction business. Your extraordinary enterprise empire is expanding. Thanks to the hard work of your Pond Voyage representative, 
How could I ever repay repay you? Remember to start working on your next premium property. Locate your nearest shark lighting agent and press the green button. Okay, so can we open a new zone? Oh, how quaint. Come visit an old lady when you can, will you? Okay, we're gonna go see Barb. And we've got a new shark sign. Did we get anything new in here? We did not. Okay. Welcome to the Pond Village Leadership and Advancement Program. You can now further improve this establishment. Successfully doing so will increase guest expectations for this location. Also increasing, pay, increasing payout and bragging rights. In order to improve this premise, you must now successfully complete the following task. Build five level two bedrooms in A24. A cool trinket that can help tell time. You feel able to complete this task? Yeah, we can do that. Task in progress. Please return when complete. Okay. Um, one, two, three, four. How am I supposed to put five bedrooms in here? I'm going to have to play with it. I don't know that I'm going to get five bedrooms in there. Making your way all over the place, aren't you? Barely got here and you're right on my track. That's right, old lady, you better watch your back or I might build you a bedroom. What? I'm not following you. <laughs> you seem to have made it to the little concrete island. Arguably, arguably an oasis worse than the desert it's saving you from. Place used to host all sorts of people, but mostly those without a lot of time on their hands. One of them, a sailor, a captain I should say, father to three strong boys, he had a lot of unexpected stops to make. Some would say his work was hectic, hostage to the wishes of the sea. He would make the stop so often that he'd have a regular room all to himself. One could wonder, perhaps, why his room would also come with regular guests all to himself. Maybe he didn't like sleeping alone? I tried swimming once at the poor lake. Questioning bear noises? I suppose when the frost and sea follows you, even ashore, you curl up to any ember you can find. He kept books on all marine travel, even showed it to me once. It was pride and joy. Schedule, like clockwork, the coordinates, the ships, their names. It was so fascinating, I couldn't help myself, and I stashed it under a wardrobe. And he never saw it again, and neither did I. Came back here with a blind hope that chaos spared this little book. There was nothing but rubble and dust, not even a standing wardrobe to look under. If you happen to cross, come across an old leathered book, do an old lady a favor, would you? You mean this book? Is that what I think it is? No, it isn't. <laughs> you know, I never used to see any animals like you just roaming around. We were lucky to hear birds some days. Now all, now you all seem to be running the place. Not that I'm complaining, you're probably more qualified anyway. You do seem like you're getting things back into shape. This road used to be full of cars and buses, people chasing other people's problems. Or sometimes their own, but rarely. You never had time to look after yourself. Oh, there I go again, blabbering to a bear. Mm, we're gonna go with a long time. If only you could blabber back and keep an old lady company. I seem to have fallen out of practice with that. Keeping company. But I'm not here to throw a pity party. It's hardly enough booze for that. Thank you. I don't feel happy. Excuse me, I have a long walk ahead of me. Where are you going? Where are you going, Barb? I gotta figure out how I'm making five rooms in this hotel. Barely got four in there. With the distillery. Oh, it's Sabine. Fancy meeting you here, mister. Figured something must have gone down south. Too many folk out of nowhere. Damn sharks got people coming in droves. I have to go keep an eye out on the dam near the lake. So barrier up to High Lake is open. If you make your way up there, look me up. I know the place inside and out. Alright, so... New routes. High Lake and Dark Grove. Alright. How am I supposed to make this into five rooms? Now I see when you're trashy. Okay.
Now I suppose I could put a room right here. And move the desk over here. Maybe. It'd have to be two by three. One. All right, first things first. We need a bed. Okay, gotta be big enough to hold those, right? And then, Okay, we've got some issues going on with our um, our ish, our stuff here. So, uh, we're, we're gonna go. We're gonna quit to menu. Save our progress. Uh, we're gonna log back in and see if we can fix what we were at. Uh, see what's going on. If if that fixed it. Or if we have to close the whole game. The game does not like for me to open OBS prior to opening it. Yeah, no, we're still stuck. Um, and I can't... Yeah, it's not letting me out of that. All right, we're gonna travel and see if, if that fixes our issue here. But I'm not, I'm not expecting it. Nope. Let's see if, if ticking into this one changes things. Nope, it does not. All right. We're gonna have to restart the game, um, and I don't mean restart from the beginning. We're gonna we're gonna call it here, and uh, we're gonna see if restarting the game completely this next time fixes those things. If not, uh, I guess I may have to restart the game from scratch. I don't know. We'll see. I'll submit. I may submit a bug report. We'll figure it out. Um, but anyway, thanks for playing some more Bear and Breakfast with me and, uh, suffering through my excited, <laughs> uh, moments at the beginning, uh, with our partner, our new Proton Pack and friends. And so the, uh, the, the friends and I here in the room will see you next time, stars, and I hope you've had an, uh, an enjoyable time. With this video if you do like and subscribe give me some comments tell me about the sound tell me about what you do and don't like like i said tell me about your collections tell me about you uh, i would love to interact with you guys more i will probably do a stream sometime soon a live stream but it will not most likely be not not be bear and breakfast it will probably be uh either um we may start cult of the lamb or we may go into some dinkum and see how that's doing now that it's had a little little break and a couple of updates and I haven't I haven't played with it in a bit and so we'll see but I've got an I know I have a couple of big events here on my end that are coming up and I won't have as much time to do live streams right now so I'm trying to get more content out for you guys um, but again if you like what you're seeing like and subscribe tell me all about it and I will see you guys in the next video bye